the Tiger Turf Stadium in Gloucester for this Boxing Day festive match. Nothing festive about this one. In goal number 21, Zach Jaycock. Eight, uh, Louis McCrory. Two, Max Ram. 14, Ben Richards Everton. Three is Jamie Record. 15, Alfie Santos. 11, Harry Pinchard. 17, Harry Emmett. Uh, 13, the skipper Joe Hanks. Uh, 20, Josh Smile. And number nine, Danny Wright. And on the in goal, number one, Curtis Pond. Two, Aaron Skinner. Four, the one change, Oreo Tashira. Six, Paul Downing. Seven, Yusuf Osise. Eight, Alex Babos. Nine, Jason Cowley. 15, Tom Pugh. 20, birthday boy, Lasana Mendes. 21, Ollie Southern. And 27, Nathan Cameron. Record now on this left-hand side. Goes inside to Emmett, who may look to go down the left-hand side as himself. That's a brilliantly ball threaded through to Jamie Record. Looks to cut it back towards goal. Goes across everybody. And eventually blazed over. Louis McGrory it was. Hanks looks to go low and finds Alfie Santos cleared off the line. And Santos goes back in for a challenge on Cameron. And he has been penalised, but that was another golden opportunity. G Crocs ball forward. Hanks and right beneath it. Hanks looks to bring it down on his chest. Right looks to bring it down for Hanks on his chest. That's a great ball forward bomb from Tejera. Two Hereford shirts with it. Richards Everton looks to clear. That's a really poor clearance. Picked up by Mendes. Cowley's up there in support with him. Cowley lets it run. Cissé will hit. Chase down. Cissé again deflected. And it will be a corner ball. And the corner will be taken on this near side by Alex Babas. Babas out swinging. Met by the head of Cowley. We just dropped into the gloves of Zach Cheecock. McGrory sending it long now. That seems to be Gloucester's main asset so far. And that's a loose touch by Downing. And Danny Wright's racing through. One and one. Is he being pulled back? Good save by Pond. Well, that was the first real opportunity for Danny Wright this afternoon. Cissé looking dangerous now, but it seems like that chance has given City a bit more confidence and a bit more verve about them. Geekot looks to fire it again. That's a poor defensive header from Cameron. And Danny Wright was in again and he scored, but the offside flag was raised. Mendes. That's a great little flick to find Alex Bavis, who brings it down and has a shot, but couldn't keep it down. And that was the first real opportunity the visitors have had all afternoon and it fell to Alex Babas. Checks the side of the centre of the park and looks to set away Cowley and Max Ram has to backpedal. Shooting towards the away fans now, here's Cowley. Skinner's on the, on the underlap if he wants and goes towards the ball and his cross comes back to Cissé and there's 1-0 to Hereford. Well, a City mistake is penalised. And Yusifi Cissé gives the away side a lead with their first break of the, first, of the second half. And their first shot on target in the game. Well, he looked dangerous. He started the attack. He nipped upon a loose ball from out. Had it back into the area. And Cissé had a simple tap in. That's an unorthodox close by Cameron. And it's met by the head of Emmett. Just away by Downing. Not fully cleared, though, by Southern. Santos awaits McGorry on the overlap. That's not a bad ball in. Met by the head of Hanks and it lands on top of the net. Santos flicked it on, but it's come through to Skinner. And Hereford have it again. Harry Pinchard looks to put on the press on Cameron. And that's superbly hit by Harry Pinchard. Racing through, one and one. Squares up to Pond and scores. The former Hereford man with a superb goal. His first for the club. Well, we said that Hereford looked dodgy at the back. And you could see in his eyes, he set off. He had venom in his eyes and took it off the toes of Cameron. That's good play. And here's Harry Pinchard. Left foot is sweeping towards the back stick, met by Emmett. Two City players went up for it and got caught in a muddle. That's good play by Babas. And now Cissé can drive it forward. And it's a 4v3. Hereford coming forward now with the goal scorer, Cissé. He's got Mendes to his right. Gives it to Mendes, who looks to square it, but a really good block by Josh Smile, who is... His loose ball forward is picked up by Santos, who turns. McGrory's on the overlap if he wants him. Smalley's in behind, and he's taken it. He's onside as well. Let's cut it back to Danny Wright, who scored the veteran striker in his golden years with a golden goal for Gloucester. Danny Wright with a bullet header 
to completely turn the game around for the hosts. Brandon Smalley played the off offside line to a tee. He's been doubled up by Ramman McGorry, but he does well to work it to the byline and cuts it back to Andy Williams. Richard Dempsey got a toe. Cissé replies. And it's hit the post. Skinner has picked up a more central position now, the makeshift left back. He's sent it over the top for Cissé and Max Ram misjudged then has to retreat. Here's Cissé. It's a clip towards the back post where Andy Williams is waiting and it's put it in. Hereford have equalised where there was that danger. And it's the big man off the bench, Andy Williams, with his first goal for Hereford. To even the honours here at the Tiger Turf. Well, Hereford were never quite down, they were never quite asleep. A great cross in by Cissé. And Andy Williams with a header at the back post, unmarked, to make it two goals each. It goes in and goes down, but the referee plays advantage. And now it's with the danger man, Cissé. Only Cowley up in support with him if he wants. Williams is making a charge. Cowley goes from range, and that wasn't too far over. Oh, that's a poor back pass from Harry Pinchard. And Harry Williams is racing through a goal. Three players trying to get back at him. The angle's tied, and he's hit the side netting. So much space down the left-hand side. Four white shirts up with him. Skinner's busting to make a run. Pew cuts inside. Oh, it's a good save by, J by Zach Geecock. In swinging right on top of the keeper. Missed by everybody and in. Jason. But the referee has given the goal. Fans are on the pitch. Oh, hang on, I can't see what's being made out. The referee's... The referee's given a foul. The goal's not going to count. Jason Cowley, if anyone was deserving of the winner, it was him. Downing. So much space for Cissé, who's encouraged to run by the away fans, and Ram's going to have to backpedal. He takes it beyond Ram, who cuts it across. Goal! And it's skied. What a chance. Jason Cowley it was. Now with Skinner. Richards goes in over the top of Cowley over adventurously and that's a free kick in a dangerous area. It's the danger man, Yusufi Cisse, over the free kick. He does go for goal, taking the nick off the wall on the way through and it's gone in! Hereford have won it! Andy Williams off the bench with a brace. Curtis Pond up to celebrate. And it's heartbreak for Gloucester, who couldn't hold on. The free kick took a deflection. And at the back post, Williams flicks it in to give Hereford the win. This one won't get ruled out. Heartbreak for Gloucester, jubilation for Hereford. And it's 3-2. Here's Zach Jacob. Jacob's out of his goal to claim it. He wants to take it, send it long himself. Surely not long left. Richard Everton missed his flick on. Cissé will try and watch that out for a, a throw in. And there's the full time whistle. Hereford have done it. What a game at the Tiger Turf. Five second half goals. Hereford led, led, then Gloucester led with 10 minutes from time. But Andy Williams, the super sub off the bench, two goals in injury time to rescue a win for Hereford that at one point looked unlikely.